it's uh, 694, so we'll get us a worksheet here. You want it in here evenly so that it, uh, if it has pockets, that's a place where oil can get trapped and you don't want the oil to get trapped. You want it to be consistently across the, the puck. So. so this is a pain. We got new technologies that we're playing with to get this bag built faster. And we have bigger bags. You know, they can be as big as the plate. I'll use some bigger bags later. Just the little ones work real good too. So we get it all nice and uniformed in there. Nice and nice hard little puck, we call it. Fold it over nice and neat, a little quarter inch fold on it. Open this bad boy up, let her iron her, since we got an iron at our fingertips. Just kind of crease it there to... We want to control the directional flow. We call this directional flow. So I'm like building myself a little higher plane. It's going to be in, it's going to hold it up here a thickness. I'm going to do the same thing over here. I'm trying to get it to fit the, the puck. So we turn that around. There's a kid named Soil Grown that kind of pushed us all, helped us get to where we're at way back last year. So he has a technique that uses a higher temperature, a little faster press. Other of us do lower temperatures and longer times with, with higher pressures. They like to get in there and get it done quick and and get out of there and so there's different techniques one tastes better it's just like dabbing you dab uh, low temperature you get more turps you dump with a high temperature it burns the turp up it's harshy it makes you cough all the above 205 206 on the top 211 on the bottom there we go so we got the package all lined up look down in here here's your can you see in there and see the package and everything oh i can't so we're warming her up first. We got no pressure on it. The gauge is sitting at zero still. We're just creeping in. We're waiting for a little waterfall to happen. Okay, we're starting to see some bubbling maybe. We're at a half a ton, a ton now. So there's a little ooze going on right now. See the little line that it's painting? Because we created those two channels for it to flow. So that's our directional flow kicking in right now. So we know that we got it warmed up. We know we got it oozing. So now we come with the pressure. So now it's going to start creeping up and just press it all out of there. As you can see, this is what we call a waterfall. Try to keep my hand out in front of you guys. And we're up to about eight tons now. And we're still gushing and we're still running. It's kind of a, a feel, you know. We do it 100, 200 times a day and this is what happens. Thank you.